everyone, September 2nd, 2018. Um, we are at Harvey Quarry, and this land is for sale right now. And geologically, this is very interesting. It's been studied in detail. Its location is on the west side of US 41. Lake Superior is that way, along with uh, the Michigan uh, rest area. But uh, you see a lot of stuff like this. This is, uh, a, this is probably a chunk of Mesnard Quartzite. This is all Paleoproterozoic. Most of this, most of the stuff here is Paleoproterozoic. Some of it's older. But what you got here, I'm trying to do this from memory, so forgive me. Uh, you've got the Mesnard Quartzite here. You've got the Kona uh, Dolomite here, or marble. Uh, and it's very tightly folded. There's like a syncline here. We're on the edge of the Marquette Synclinorium. But the most prominent feature, you can't really tell by looking at the rock from here. There's a lot of stromatolite. There's a marker bed that's, a, that's stromatolitic within the Kona. That's how we know this is a syncline. Uh, but that's not the most prominent feature here. The most prominent feature here is a shear zone. This very white looking part right here uh, with the brown kind of muddled part there. The gray stuff over there is, if memory serves, I'll correct me if I'm wrong, I'll correct myself, uh, is the Kona which is a lot older, all right? So we have a shear zone here, which is basically kind of like a fault zone, but not really. It's, there's more, there's a, you get rocks of different ages pushed hard against one another, like you wouldn't have fault, but there's not a lot of brittle deformation along the plane. It's, it's, it's a lot more uh, ductile. Uh, and, the, and what's called that brown part is called the Enchantment Lake Formation. That's actually Paleoproterozoic and, and it's a glacial deposit um, at that shear zone. So this is just a really cool part here. This used to be quarried for the hard. This rock is really hard, very hard stuff. In some of the talus, you can see uh, the, some of the schist parts of the Kona. That would be schist part. That's concrete. <laughs> But uh, yeah, th this is a mix of Mesonard and Kona here. See, the thing is with uh, the Kona, it's, it's basically a salacious dolo stone, metamorphosed. So in a lot of parts of it are quartzite that strongly resemble the Mesnard. This is a detached block. This is likely, definitely Kona. Um, but there's some cool stuff here. You can see slick insides from movement here. Uh, Oh, the, no, this is quartzite. This might be Mesnard, but there's some ripples on it, too. That's what first caught my eye as I was coming up on it. You can see some bigger ripple structures. Anyway, that's it. I hope you learned something.